Hey guys, today is a Tuesday. I actually want to get my nails did. I haven't done my nails in like three years now. What since 2018, I have not done my nails. I've not like gone to the salon to do my nails. Every nail you see me carry since that time has either been press ons or just my natural nails i have not gone to the salon to do my nails because before then i was always fixing my nails and my nails it got really weak so i just had to take a break but now it's it is strong and honestly the press ons i love press ons because when i'm having press ons on i don't actually want them to stay so long but they've been falling quicker than i expect them to fall out i've come across this nail salon nailycure.ng i've asked them for their i'm going to put a screenshot of their page here i've asked them for their price list before i think their price list used to be on their bio but it's no longer there i don't know why people do this kind of stuff though it is so annoying like let people see what they want to buy it's only appointment only so even if you want to book an appointment you don't have a price list you don't know what they are offering i have sent i left um a comment on one of their posts they did not reply i have sent a message to them asking for their price list so that i can know if it is within my budget because i think people do spend crazy amounts of fixed nails and I don't think I'm ready to spend even up to 10,000 fixing my nails. If it is going to be up to 10K, I don't think I'm going to do it because the highest nail, the highest press on nails I have bought is not up to 10,000, either 8K or something. It is not up to 10K. So that's going to be a lot. And I think they are based in phase one. So I'm going to actually transport myself again to phase one, spending how much just to get my nails done. Um, no. So let me give them a call now. I'm going to actually leave you guys on the phone. Let me give them a call and see what they say. So this is me calling them. It's ringing, guys. It's ringing. Hello. Good evening. Am I on to Nelly Cure? Okay. Um, I would like to know your price list so I can be able to book an appointment. I sent a message on Instagram, but I didn't get any response. So I decided to call, yeah. I'm so sorry about that. No problem. Um, okay, so I should send it to your DM, right? Okay, let me do that. Uh, thank you. Currently, their price list is down, and I should send a picture of what I want to do, and then they will give me the price relating to the picture of the nail that I want to fix. So apparently, it's, it's whatever you ordered, that is what you're going to get. The price of whatever you want to do is what you're going to get. So, guys. I am going to send her a picture of what I want to do. I'll put a picture of what I want to do on the screen so that you can see as well. And then I'll tell you guys what they say. So guys, it's seven minutes since I sent them a message, a picture of what I want to do and still no response. So I'm just going to wait it out because today is Tuesday. I'm trying to make that nails on Thursday. But yeah, I'll let you guys know if there's any updates. A few minutes later. <laughs> guys so they finally replied so it is fourteen thousand five hundred naira just to do my nails whoa that is a lot of money if i actually go through with it that is going to be the highest i have spent on my nails I actually have to stick with press on nails though because i have never bought press ons for that amount before that is crazy and it depends on the length you see the exact length in that in the picture is the exact length that i want to do and they said 14.5 depending on the length and i'm like the exact length in this picture she said yes that that's the amount so if you want a longer length you pay a higher price honestly i was expecting like nine thousand naira give or take yo i really have to think about this if i actually oh man god you see you guys <laughs> creating content is not easy you will not be skipping somebody's ads somebody 
watch my ads or don't skip my ads to create content is not easy yo so i'm actually going to really think about this and if i actually want to spend such amount on my nails those nails <laughs> better last long anyways see you guys later good morning guys it is thursday morning it is currently past 8 a.m i booked the nail appointment for 12 because of the crazy traffic i have to go and you know freshen up and actually leave so that i can get there on time on a normal day i'm supposed to leave here by 11 or 11:30. 11 but Lagos and traffic 5 and 6 to book you have to pay a compulsory 5,000 naira I'm just waking up from sleep so that's why my voice is like this you have to pay 5,000 naira to book your appointment I already planned to film this video so that's why I'm going along with it everything is just about spending money to make money hopefully i make the money back through this video so please don't skip my ads watch my ads share my videos hit the like button hopefully it is a fun experience hopefully it is worth the money but yeah let's bounce so guys i am set to go my boat ride is almost here so this is my outfit i'm just wearing I don't know if you guys can see I'm just wearing a simple dress it has a rope but well, I notice that whenever I tie the rope it just makes me so uncomfortable and it keeps pulling the dress up my go-to handbag and my face mask which is going to come on later but yeah I am off to get the nails did done if I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me What would you do? If I told you you were beautiful Would you date me on the regular? Tell me would you Well baby I've been around the world But I ain't seen myself another girl like you this ring here represents my heart but there's just one thing i need from you say i do because my first time here right. so i'd like to know how you guys operate i'm new to that sorry okay. so it's okay to film right yes. okay so this um pedicure everything is part of the package oh no it's not they don't all come together but okay you can get a pedicure which is advisable if like for example now the way your manicure isn't around uh, right now mm -hmm. you can get a pedicure mm -hmm. so while you're waiting you'll be here soon mm -hmm. so you can start your manicure okay so that's a separate part yes, so is this how you guys use all the time? You have to show a picture before you get the prize of something. Is it for the nail? Yes. Oh yeah, for nail. We yes. advise to show a picture because also like the length of the nail depends on the price. So we would like to see to be able to tell you how much this is this and this is this. Okay. Yeah. So um why your price is not up on your page? Not up on our page, yeah. Right now. Okay, I'm not aware of why it's not up, but because you cannot just put everything up like that. It's quite a lot. So Actually, on, even if it's like the basics or something people get different things so you can never say this is what people do the most people do different things so it's like when you tell us what you want we tell you this is it this is it okay like basically now if you want to do a pedicure a manicure i don't know maybe i don't know any other service aside like the length of the meal the style mm -hmm. the price is of that is there yes, no it's not oh like on the page yeah oh, no, the price is Okay, so what is the price for the pedicure, manicure, and all those things? Okay, so it depends on the type you are, you are getting actually. Okay. For the pedicure, we have like four main types of pedicures. We have the classic, mm -hmm. that's the regular, mm -hmm. okay. We have the indulgent, mm -hmm. we have the. Um, I'm actually new here. Oh, okay. Yeah, but That's fine. I'm pulling up. Yeah. So you have the jelly, you okay. have the classic, you have the luxury. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so the new text, I will tell you which one actually they know best about it. So, the ones that I to do this, do that. Okay. Yeah. So, people, some people don't actually know what they may want. So, do advise them based on that. Okay, so what are the difference in prices? Okay, in prices. So, the jelly pedicure mm -hmm. is 10500 naira. Mm -hmm. And with gel polish is 13,000 naira. Mm -hmm. And 
luxury nine thousand. The gel polish eleven five. Classic seven thousand naira. The gel polish ten thousand naira. Indulgent ten thousand naira and the gel polish thirteen thousand naira. Okay, so that's about it. All right, thank you. So when is this person going to be around? Okay, he'll be here shortly. So you. I can see us holding hands, walking on the beach, our toes in the sand. I can see us on the countryside, sitting on the grassland side by side. You could be my baby, let me make you my lady. Girl, you amaze me, ain't gotta do nothing crazy. See, all I want you to do is be my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away. And another woman that can take your spot, my love. So don't give away my love. So don't give away my love. Guys, we are still waiting and waiting. Someone's going to start my nail prep now, and then the guy over there is going to continue my nails. That guy, while well, she is going to prep my nails. Okay guys, I am back home. It was a fun experience. I'm not even going to lie. It was a fun experience. These are the nails. Focus. These nails are so cute. I like it. Here is my honest, honest review because I just gotta say the way it is. I still feel like 14,500 naira is still kind of much. I'm going to put the equivalent on the screen in dollar. Just because I'm someone that likes beating down price and getting things at a very affordable price. Even if some people might think that it's affordable. But to me, I just feel like it's still kind of on the high side. If it was like 10k, that would have been more understandable for me. But I must commend their professionalism. They were really professional. The work they put into filing these nails. It's almost three years now. It's almost three years I've had nails done. So, and honestly, I'm never going to lie. I've not had, let me call it professional nails done. I always just go to a salon. I'm calling this professional because they used correct equipment, used gel, used, you know, all these things. And you can say that they are charging for this equipment and stuff, which makes a lot of sense. So there's a first time for everything. I really like it. And honestly, compared to the persons, 
these feel really lightweight on my hand unlike the press ones i have to do myself maybe because i'm not a professional i always i always know that i have nails on i don't feel like i have nails on it is it's just like when i do like this i remember that oh i i fixed my nails i do not it's not heavy it's not heavy it feels so lightweight compared to my press on and i don't feel any pain even though there was a little bit of because of my skin she kind of filed a bit of my skin but i don't feel any pain sometimes my press on they come in and they don't fit my nail bed properly so i have to force it in and sometimes you can see my natural nails and then it just hurts me a lot i don't feel any pain at all let me rate my experience over 10 i am going to rate it an 8 an 8 because i stuck to my appointment time my appointment time was for 12 i got there 11 40 and the guy that was supposed to attend to me went for home service so they were trying to sell me their pedicure service which i was going to pay for I feel like that doesn't make sense. You cannot just impose that on someone. You don't know if the person, you know, has a budget or if the person planned for this. And I just, I said I wasn't going to do that. I just wasn't buying any of that. I came for this and I'm going to get this because their cheapest pedicure is like 7,000. And if you're going to round it up, that's me spending 20 something thousand. No, I did not budget for that. I waited for like um, almost an hour because I got there 11 40 and they said they attended to me almost 1, 1 p.m. So because of that, it's going to be an 8. But yeah, aside that, I really love my nails. I think their services are good. I think they actually bring the what you want, what you ordered for versus what you got to life they actually try their best i'm going to put a picture of what i ordered for on the screen again and just take a look i totally love it nearly cure nice service i'm definitely going to visit you guys again but not anytime soon in total i spent twenty thousand plus because my transports go in and my transports come in is like five thousand five thousand two hundred naira or something so everything is like twenty thousand seven hundred or something so yeah that's the end of this video if you liked it give it a thumbs up share my video please like this video subscribe if you haven't subscribed and yeah i'll see you in my next one bye